Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And today I have a unboxing of the MX Master 2S. It's the latest model. I've been watching YouTubers such as MKBHD who use the first one, the MX Master 1S, I believe. Video about it, and I mean, I totally like the uh, the way look. He told me, you know, you know, he talked about you know the sensitivity, the buttons, the side buttons, the range, the build quality, and I believe the old one also had you know the Logic Tech Flow, where he, you know he's able to use two different computers with two different OS and it's, I believe it's connected over to Wi-Fi so you know it's easy to um, to use multiple devices um, so just to read some of its features it uses the dark field high precision tracking it tracks on any surface even glass up to 4000 dpi um, the, the better and it's able to you know just on any surface I mean you don't have to do it with a, a mouse pad or trackpad or whatever you want to call it and I think that's good because I mean I have a laptop the Mac and you know I'm on a desk with wood and I could just you know use the mouse anywhere also, uh, it's fast charge with battery, holds up to 70 days on a full charge. So honestly, that's a really long time. Also, it's unique scrolling experience, smart speed adaptive scroll wheel features, auto shift, from click to click to hyper fast scroll, plus a dumb wheel for side to side scrolling. And also the comfortable shape. So it's time to open it up. Need a boxing ring. Give me one minute. With a boxing knife, I just grabbed it from my kitchen. Hopefully, my mom won't be mad. It's not that sharp. I'm just gonna touch this in case. Standard USB A to micro USB uh, adapter that you can plug into your um, device. So let's set it up. to say like I honestly do like the feeling of it I mean like this thing is just it feels smooth especially this side button right here super smooth let me try clicking buttons no we had to download the Logitech flow I believe I mean I'm not too sure if we have to What I just noticed there is like when you just scroll one time, it's like you can feel it. Like you can absolutely feel the. See if you can hear it.
but if you like let go really fast, it turns super smooth. Then you can feel like the ridge, like, you know, you can feel the, um, the ratchet, I'm guessing. I'm not too sure, but you can feel it. But once you like go really fast, it turns to a small wheel. Like, um, it's a lot smoother. That's honestly really impressive. Downloading this. Guess update. It says Logitech options that you customize gesture controls for Logitech touch products. Also, adds enhanced keys. I mean, it's for the wireless mouse, it makes master and everything. So, let's try that. So, I figure out how to do the flow. Well, honestly, I don't need it because I'm just using this computer and that's really it. But I am looking through. The logic thing is just a way to, um, I guess, your point of speed. Uh, very sensitive. Scrolling speed. Smooth scrolling. Not too sure what that does. changes between a smooth rolling oh. and this button I can program it to cut my brightness down so this button press it it becomes I don't know how to say it hold up yeah. trying to figure out what like the, this mechanism is I mean, I guess good words a, a mechanism where you just have to lightly push it and it'll just boop, like boop, 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 like that. And this button just regular makes it scroll really fast. I'm trying to figure out, let's see, even on a box, what do they call it? They don't call it anything. But I mean, it's hard to explain it. Like, I mean, a normal, you know how a normal, let's say an old school mouse would just make that noise. See, when you like go down really fast, I guess whatever's holding it to make that noise, let's go. And this, I guess this button also controls it. So you can hear it like, it going up or get going down to stop the um, wheel. So that's really cool. I mean, you can even tell this like there's something actually like holding on, I guess, into one of these ridges because like if I go to the fast mode and I spin real fast and I press the button, like sometimes you hear like something like pushing up against the wheel and stopping it. So it's something physical in there and it's, you know, what's causing, you know, this action and able to unlock it. So it'll scroll real smooth. That's, to me, that's just super dope. Uh, that's cool. So I'm just here. So I'm just using it real quick on, um, Premiere Pro and using it to like slide up and down to scroll. I mean, this thing is super cool. I probably like the smooth view better. So, um, AC guys, I mean, this, this part is also a button. 
I'm gonna do that to my Mac on D4. I can change it. The material, it's like this smooth, fake. I mean, it just it's rubbery. I don't say like fake leather, but it, it's not. It's a soft touch material. I definitely like that. Rest plastic. I mean, I would like to see, you know, a little bit of metal here, you know, but I feel like it will affect its, um, the weight too much. And with plastic, you're able to just control the weight of the, uh, the item better, the mouse better. So guys, there you go with um, my review. I mean, not really reveals, more than unboxing with first impressions. And probably later on, I'll give like a small review on, you know, how I like it, is it useful? You know, how does it hold up and stuff like that. So thank you guys for watching. Remember to subscribe, comment, and like the video. Um, especially comment, I really, you know, at this point, I'm new. I'd rather have you guys tell me what I need to improve on instead of, you know, subscribing and liking. Those also help, but tell me down below what I can do to improve my channel and the videos. And, you know, show some love. So, there you go, guys. Have a good day, and thank you for watching. Thank you.